You don't actually believe a single word I'm saying, do you? this order I'm not really sure <laughs> so this one's the blueberry rebalancing skin from Innisfree <laughs> you really look so like beginner I am like, I've never done this before. <laughs> I've never done this before <laughs> I don't use skincare I would use moisturizer and then like how much do you need do you just like pat it yeah, on just pat it just on, pat it on yeah. oh it smells like blueberry yeah <laughs> <laughs> hopefully my laugh lines will go away because I have like so many laugh lines I feel old, you know? Okay, the so next product is a combination of the Nature Republic Aqua Moisturizer and the Biore um, sunscreen. I never put on sunscreen because it's so greasy. This is, uh, you know, water-based, so yeah, hopefully it'll be better. Looks like this. It smells so good. <laughs> Like this, you right? didn't put any on your forehead. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't remove the makeup. Oh, you didn't remove the makeup. <laughs> yeah, just on okay. my cheeks. Okay. You know, save products because okay. we're students. And this is the next one. <laughs> and it's watery base, so it's like super nice, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. Hopefully, I won't get any more tan. I think I changed like three shades this summer. <laughs> have all this extra okay if you haven't noticed I haven't been putting on my forehead because I didn't remove the makeup from my forehead okay there you go then the next thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna put on concealer and this is not what I bought on this trip but it's a concealer I use every day so this is the NYX HD concealer super cheap love it <laughs> <laughs> oh sorry <laughs> <laughs> just getting closer to your face I want to go watch a YouTube video. <laughs> okay, and then this product we did buy in Asia. Oh, someone's smoking weed. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Shiseido Aqua Label um, oh, Powder Foundation. So <laughs> it's this is smaller than the one with the actual packaging. Okay, so I bought this. It's a very limited space in my suitcase. It looks like this, and it comes with a little sponge, applicator sponge. So we're gonna start applying. I have no mirror. I have no idea what I'm doing. Do you want to flip out the... Dude, I can't. The lighting's way too good. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I don't want to do it. I need a mirror. How do YouTubers do this? Do they have a giant like mirror in front of them? Yeah, they do. Oh, so pretty. It looks so bad. In the light. Wait, actually, so pretty. The lighting's so good too. And then make sure you put some on your neck because when you go out and travel in the summer, you turn a darker shade than your foundation, and you're gonna have like two different shades. Okay, so after that, we're gonna put on some blush. Um, where's my blush, guys? <laughs> where's the entire bag? Yeah, where's the bag? <laughs> <laughs> So these are the brushes I take with me when I travel. These two brushes, I can do anything I want. So I'm gonna use Mamoot. Mamond. Mamond. <laughs> They're really pretty, it's like a rose. Reminds me of the first blush I ever bought from TNT. <laughs> a Japanese brand, it's really pretty. Oh. I know this has bronzer on it, but you know. <laughs> and then apply it to the apples of your cheeks. 
like, you know, smile and that's it. <laughs> Yo, I need more product. Oh. <laughs> we'll have assistants too, this is so nice. <laughs> okay, not entirely balanced, but good enough. And then just because I have my Becca Cosmetics highlighter, I'm gonna put a little bit of that on as well. I'm like almost hitting pan with the white one. That one's my favorite. It is called Pearl. Okay, we're done with the face. Grab me two random eyeshadows and we'll improvise with the look. These are the eyeshadows that have been selected for me for this video. So we have this one. Oh, yeah, there you go. Good. We have <laughs> this one. This one is so pretty. The bling bling eyeshadow stick in like gold or something. Like, there's no shade on it. So yeah, we're gonna try this out and see how it goes. Oh, I didn't prime my eyes. All over your lid, just as a base to give it a very neutral look. Like compared to my other eye, this one's more neutral. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like Joyce. And <laughs> you're like directors, you're so serious. <laughs> Like that. <laughs> <laughs> I remember once in grade nine, I told her to do my makeup, and I went home, and she put, she gave me like black eye, full on black eye, <laughs> <laughs> and everyone was staring at me. <laughs> All the moms were like, I have my hair like emo with like dark. Oh my eyes. god, so it was pretty bad. This one is the satin, so I'm doing my best with them and applying them with my finger. Oh, this one's so pink. I like it. I like how I'm discovering what color they are as I'm putting them on. Hers is so red. Yeah, yeah dude. It's, how red does it look on camera? It's really red. Really red? Okay, it doesn't look that bad in real life. So I'm gonna put some gold on it. It's like, it's fine. This is fine. Put some gold on top to blend out the red. Especially in the center of your lids because, you know. You want to make the center of your eyes pop. And it'll look like a sunset or something. Like in the Lion King. Oh, you're so cool. I'm so warm. Dude, I'm, I'm sweating. <laughs> Stop <laughs> sweating, directors. Okay. So that's for the eyeshadow. Round to I like know, I think yeah. you need a little bit dark to neutral. That's okay. I have a product. We're gonna... <laughs> <laughs> this is from the face shop, Triple Eyes, in Mocha Nuance. I love this little palette because you could do like a casual look or a party look with this and you just bring it with you everywhere. I bought it in New York. <laughs> just pop it in the corner. It's starting to put on a lot of eyeshadow. It's because I bought all the naked palettes and I never use them. Oh, really she like has so much makeup that she doesn't use. Yeah. So I'm actually going to start using them. Actually, to be truthful to the camera, I'll show you the one eyeshadow I use every single day because it's very subtle. It doesn't look like you have a crazy amount of eyeshadow on. I don't think we'll have time for that. This one's my absolute favorite. Urban Decay shout out and Space Cowboy. This one is You're just totally a off top. It's just like <laughs> shimmer you put on the top. Oh, didn't that come with the set I gave you? Was yeah, and then I dropped it and cracked it and then I bought another one. Oh, that was so one. sad. Okay, now for the mascara, the final step. This eyelash curler is the Shu Uemura one, the one that every YouTuber talked about. I bought it in Japan, like few years ago and it was like 12 bucks compared to 20 at Sephora so buy it in Japan if you can squeeze okay so the mascara we're gonna use is a heroin make um, yeah everyone talks about this tell me your story about how oh yeah so I wear mascara every day to work right for the past like two years and this little girl who's been going for the past two years she never noticed never comments on anything and then the other day I wore this one she's like Wow, you're wearing mascara today! I'm like, <laughs> I've been wearing mascara every day for the past two years. She's like, like something's different about your eyes. So clearly, this one works better than the other one I was using. I know it's really expensive too. Look how it fans out your eyelashes. It makes it thick and perky. Make sure you do bottom lashes too. This is the Too Cool for School Contour Kit. It's to take your bronzer brush and swirl it around and then apply it to your face. Um, these two shades are for your nose and these two are for the hairline. I don't put it on my nose because it always looks like I have dirt on my nose for some reason. <laughs> so, dirt on your nose? <laughs> Did you know? <laughs> just over there. So yeah, that's why I don't do it. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, my job. so I'm just gonna, you know, put a little bit here. I normally don't use contour very much. I'm more of a blush and highlight kind of person. I always contour. 
But now that I have the, I bought a giant contour kit for myself, I'm gonna start doing it more. It's just like, it's so easy to go heavy handed on it, especially if you're wearing cream um, foundation. And I'm like, I'm always in a rush when I'm doing my makeup, so I can't afford to be like wiping it off before I go to school. So I didn't bring my lipsticks, but we're just gonna go with the Soft Touch Auto Lip Liner from Etude House. This one's sort of a nude shade and... Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so, my lips are really dry. So moisturized first, guys. Dude, this is like, Aww. this quality is questionable. <laughs> Great product, but uh... <laughs> Dude, someone's looking so dreary. So this shade is kind of a My Lips But Better nude shade. It's like there's a hint of pink, but it's still mostly nudie. And this one's from Etude House. I'm just behind the camera. This <laughs> was a case that you can get at the store. So this is uh, replaceable. There are a bunch, there's like, 15 or 14, I forgot. So we're just gonna put a little dab on because I don't want it to be too red. That's a final look! <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, no, hang on. But wait! But wait! My favorite product that I bought in Japan, it was so pretty, is the Jill Stewart perfume. I normally use the Chloe one, but I ran out. So I bought this as a replacement. This is called Snow Bloom. Something like that. <laughs> it's so nice. Gotta buy liberally. <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> oh, it Can you good. smell it? Yeah. It smells so nice, right? Okay. Okay. All oh. done. Where are you going now? I'm home. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is our friend, Joyce. Hi. She bought a lot of skincare products. We bought her. a lot of skincare products for her. <laughs> so she's going to um, be here as our guest feature to demonstrate all the skincare products. Okay. So, first, Innisfree, this is called the Green Tea Seed Serum. Ooh, she's more like a YouTuber than us. Uh, yeah. Pump, 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 pump. Oh, oh shit! shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> this smells really good. That's it. I'm gonna get your neck as well. Next one I'm gonna use is Laneige Water Bank Essence, the X. This one's really popular, so I wanted to try it out. Sorry, my hands are a little dry. <laughs> a watery consistency, so. You just put it on all on your <laughs> 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 hmm, it Smells really fresh. It's the same product as Clio. This is the Nature Republic Aqua Super Aqua Max. This is the one we all three of us actually use. It smells really good. Highly recommend it. Do you secretly do YouTube? <laughs> It's really, really nice, especially for the summertime when you don't want to put on anything too heavy. It dries really fast too, so because I do have combination skin, so I have a blue one and a pink one. I think the pink one is for dry skin, the blue one is for oily skin. It's like a mess. <laughs> Two BB creams here. This is the Laneige BB Cushion for Control Pack. This is in number 23 Sand. I'm gonna use half of my face, so I'll just put this on the right. And this is the Mamon. Brightening Cover Powder Cushion in 23C. Oh, I'll put the Laneige one first. Free packaging. Oh, so <laughs> you used to match your skin color. Did you get a tan from the Canada trip? Yep. Yep. Oh. <laughs> yep. And your neck. Feels nice. Feels fairly light. This is the Mamon. So which um, one do you like better? Um, I think I like the Laneige one better. The Mamon is a bit sticky. I don't know if it's because I put on a lot of skincare products, but the Laneige one, it's a, it feels a lot more softer and a bit lighter. It yeah. looks the same, it looks same yeah, right now. Yeah. Yeah. So next up, Can Make Cream Cheek Tint On. <laughs> <laughs> so this one is from Japan. It looks really dark, just the product itself, but when you apply it, it's really light. It's cream based, so. And because I do have dark circles and a mole, um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna use this NARS Radiant Cream Concealer, medium custard.
Yo, the lighting's so good here. I know. Right? And I'm gonna pull here, so I'm just gonna use the rest. <laughs> so for lip product, we have this Jill Stewart lipstick. It's Sarah's, and it's in number 20 Promise Me. So pretty. Say all the right beauty YouTubers. Yo, it looks nice on you. Thanks. You look like a different person. <laughs> That's it. That's just the final look. It's so cheesy. <laughs> Bye. 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 Bye